the last time we left off, we had ridden to this bandit camp. Uh, that's supposed to be over here somewhere. We killed one of the bandits. He's dead, right there. Taking his gear. We are once again incredibly over-encumbered. Uh, we're also... <laughs> there's this bird. I put down a trap. But I don't know exactly if it's going to work or not. So I think what I should do is uh, go to my map and just put a marker exactly where I am right now. And then just leave this place for a while, come back, see if it worked or not. And in the meantime, we will go to the bandit camp to try and kill the rest of the bandits. I don't know if you can see the bird or not. You're definitely over there somewhere. Oh, there's some other things. I also shot an arrow at the bandit, but I missed. There's a bunny. I think the bandit camp should be over here somewhere. I rode quite a while, actually. The guy came after me for quite a while. My sword is bloodied. I don't know what that means exactly in terms of gameplay. Found an interesting sight. What's to say it's interesting, though? Who says it's interesting? I might even walk into some of the bandits. Oh, there we go. Alright, so I'm actually kind of tempted to um, throw down a bunch of the gear that I just got to make myself less overweight. Don't like dropping things just randomly on the floor, but if I put it next to my horse and hope my horse just kind of stays there. I don't really want to be overweight, so... Wait, hold on, these boots are... Yeah, they're worse, so never mind. Still a little overweight. No more gear here. I guess the arrows I picked up. Yeah, I picked up a lot of arrows. Don't really want to drop my arrows. I guess I'll drop my torch for now. It's easy to get more of those. Oh, there's a guy right there. So I do have my bow. Still. Of course. It's also not night time, so they shouldn't have too much of a hard time seeing me now. These guys look better equipped than the other ones as well, but I did just kill the archer very easily, so that's good. This guy... There's another bird. Right, I think he's already hey, seen me. Who's there? <laughs> A fucking bird. Well, Alright, never mind. Turns up willingly for the slaughter. Hey, all of you! Gather here! Raise the alarm! <laughs> Ooh, just got my head in. Yeah! Oh. 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 My sword is quite good, so. Bunda. Answer to my Ugh. prayers, just when I wanted to vent my rage on someone. Curse it! Hey! All of them, gather oh, here! Shit. Raise the alarm! I'm going to enjoy this! Oh, it comes down from the right. Get over here! You'll get one! Bring it on! I don't like this. Could run. Barely. I'm gonna try and keep him one at a time here. Oh, oh, stop. Come on, let's try to kill this guy first. He's obviously the weaker one. Although he's got a shield, so... This guy behind me as well. I hear another one. But he's not coming in to fight, apparently. Stop it. Fainting is so good, I've been told. Oh wow, I can't believe he didn't hit me there, to be honest. That was poor timing. Tree. Pretty sure this is the bandit leader, he has to be. I also got a two-handed sword. Oh, there's the archer right there. I'm moving around a lot, so he's probably gonna have a hard time hitting me, but still. I'm sorry, what? Pretty sure my, my uh, shield is gonna break at some point, although this guy will probably give me a new one, so... You know. Fucker. 
Shit. I'm not gonna take any damage because my armor, I think, is just blocking it as well. Which probably means my armor is gonna get absolutely fucked after this, but I can sell all this shit again, it doesn't really matter. He must be getting low now. He's low on stamina, he has to be. I heard him like, uh, uh. He's definitely getting hit. What's the matter? Armor's doing really well. Oh yeah. shit, he's still stronger than I am, apparently. Down. Oh, damn it. No curva. No curva. Go on. Wow. Bugger. <laughs> Wow, that was landed. And that. Oh, shit, didn't get that one. I need to wait for my health, my stamina. A little bit low here. What are you up to? Don't grow up, I don't like this. I wanna be locked on this guy because he's low now. Oh, that was unfortunate. Who's there? Someone's still not aware of this fight that's going on here. Oh man, how did I not lock that one? No, don't lock on him. That was bad. Oh, the stamina, please. This has been an epic fight, but I, I, I feel like at this point I should have won it. I'm a side guy. Should have taken that attack. That was stupid. Who's there? What's going on there? Bring it on! Damn it! Damn it! Still not taking any damage, but I'm pretty sure my armor is getting absolutely destroyed now. Who's there? There's a guy in the background. He's just walking around. Oh, that's from bleeding. All right, now it's just you and me, mate. I can't imagine you're as good a fighter as him. Not quite. This will be the shot of a fucking lifetime! No, it won't. <laughs> it certainly won't. Alright, so here's my two uh, dead friends. Time to take all of their gear. I actually, I want to check out my own gear. I want to see how busted this stuff is. Uh, so that's cloth. That's that was already busted. That's leather jerkin. Eh, some of the stuff is pretty busted, but overall, oh, mostly nine. Sorry, ninety still. So that's not bad at all. That was a sick fight. But unfortunately, he ended up dying from the actual, um, from the the bleeding. But still, also kind of looks weird. That's worth a lot of money, holy shit. I'm taking everything, I'm gonna be incredibly over... Overweight again, but... I want your shield too. Really? Can you not just pick it up? And this woodcutter's axe, sure. Have that too. Now this guy I'm more interested in, he's the bandit leader. His armor was fucking sweet. That a helmet for sure, it's gotta be better than what I've got. Kettle hat. Yeah, has to be. Mill chassis, we haven't got these, so that's gonna be better. This some of this stuff's probably better than what I've got. It's kind of busted because we had to hammer on him for quite a while, but oh shit, yeah, this is gonna be a problem now. My horse isn't too far, but it there it is. Okay, oh shit, there is still the other guy as well, the archer, and I want to check out their camp itself. What are we at right now, weight wise? One ninety nine. Right, let me check this armor actually. First of all. Okay, we already got that, we're wearing it, so this is worse because it's more busted. These are worth so much money. Cattle hat, so that is just straight up better. So we're wearing a cattle hat now, instead of the common bassinet. Uh, this is better... yep. Um, how much better? A little bit, not too much actually. I, I thought it was going to be this, but it's not. Still though, looks sweet as fuck. Milk coif is worse. Really? What have we got? We got the elongated milk coif, right? 
The gauntlets are worse as well, actually, than what we have, which is the composite gauntlets. 11. These are also 11, but they're more busted, I guess. Old boots are worse. Don't actually, that, that may have stuff, been stuff I already had. These are my old padded chassis, which are co worth quite a bit of money as well. Um, this is the same as what we have, but it's more busted. All right, so yeah, not too much good gear we got from that. We got the hat and we got the the chassis, the leg chainmail, which is pretty good. But hey, I'll take that. We got an axe. Oh shit, his sword. We got to go back for a sword because that was the thing that looked really good. Woodcutter's axe is uh, yeah, not particularly good and quite heavy. But yeah, we got to go back for that sword. Shit. Oh, he's over here. Okay. Because that is what looks really good, is the two-handed sword. I wonder if you can use it, any weapon as a two-handed sword. There it is. Nice. I'm glad I didn't have to take ages to find that. Robber sword. Looks like it just takes one. 25-25-1 isn't that bad. It's all. It's completely busted. Holy crap. Rusty Longsword, someone's granddad once bought back from his world roaming. There's nothing exceptional about it except its age and universal use, plus the fact that it's quite likely to fall to pieces in your hand. Oh. Actually, 25 durability is about the same as what we've got on our sword. Speaking of, what's our sword at after all that? Uh, that is... Saving Grace. 83. Alright, so I, I'm going to overreact a little bit. My sword isn't going to break as fast as I thought it would. God, are we overweight or what? <laughs> this is gonna just be a journey back to my horse. Then there's still more guys I want to kill, but we can use the horse to go wherever we want. Plus, I got I gotta go back to the trap. There was also another bird around here somewhere, but I think I'm gonna leave it for now. I'll come back here later for these birds because right now I am not gonna wait around for birds and shit. Hopefully my gear that I dropped there is still there, because that would be a shame if it was gone. It wouldn't be the end of the world, because I dropped mostly trash, but it's still worth quite a pretty penny. I don't see it, which is a problem. Because I placed it right next to this horse. Yeah, I think it might just be gone. That's kind of a shame. I don't know why it would randomly disappear either. Unless it rolled down a hill or something, but no, I don't think so. So yeah, a few items there were actually worth something. Well, lesson learned, I suppose. Don't drop random gear. Why is there a dead guy right there? Oh, wait, hold on. Did I kill another guy? I don't recall. But yeah, I did, didn't I? I slashed this guy down before his two mates showed up. I completely forgot about that. Hey. Thanks for the stuff. Um... Or just taking everything, so I don't know. Riveted gloves, not worse, not better than what I've got, but it's still not terrible. I'll have the lots. In fact, I'll eat those apples just to weigh me down a little less. Uh, eat. Oh, that was eat. Okay. No food poisoning, hopefully. Nope. Look at that overweight shit. Holy crap. You'd think I wouldn't even be able to climb my own horse anymore. Alright, so the camp was over here somewhere. There it is. There might be more guys here, to be honest. I should just take my sword out. Hello? What's going on there? Hello? What are you? You're gonna run. Hey. I think he might. So I'm pulling out my bow. Oh! No! I hit him in the head, it was a headshot as well. <laughs> but he... I should have should just ride him down with my horse. With my horse. I'll never find my way back here, but... Yeah, let's just wait for him to come back while we loot his camp. I hit him in the fucking back of the head, but... <laughs> he didn't die because he had a male, male coif on it. Oh, what a shot that was too, I can't believe that. Why don't I just use my horse to walk over here? It probably would be miles faster. I imagine this is locked. It's just... Sh oh, no, it's not. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. There's some pretty pennies here. My goodness. Plus 117 just straight up money. That's incredibly valuable as well. I mean, it's that's the exact value is 117, but... Just having money like that so I don't have to sell it. Plus, it doesn't weigh anything in this game. Which, they're going for historical accuracy. They should probably make money weigh something. 
All right, let's see if we can chase this guy down. Oops, I didn't mean to put my sword away. I meant to grab it, but I already had it out. Oh, there he is. Well, I never. Ah! Oh, I hit him, but. Get over here! Come here, you little shit. How is he not dying from this? Over here! Where is everyone? Quick! No, a rope. Oh, never mind. I think I can do a mercy killing on him. Oh, no, he's just died. No! No, don't go down the hill! I will never be able to catch you! No, he's going all the way down for f- Alright, I think the camp was empty. I'm pretty sure we took everything of value. There he is. Fucking hell, look at him. I'm not sure if he was carrying a weapon. Wait, where did he just go? There he is. Wow, okay. I almost lost him there. Fucking trying to hide from me, the dead corpse. Death Corpse, that's a kind of, what do you call that? A conundrum? Something else. Number 23. What are we on right now? 296. Not much as I thought we were on. An arrow that I shot in the back of his head. Unfortunately, oh no, never mind, he has 30 arrows. My word, we are going to be so overweight after this. I'm going to have to, I'm just going to have to drop arrows as well in my, uh, in my plane, place thingy. Oh, nice, a silver ring. Wild Boar Tusk. Not worth a whole lot, but I'll take it. Not sure why he asked that. I'll take the lot. Nothing there that I want to wear, though. Will you still carry me, horse? I'm so sorry that I've been putting you through all this. How convenient. Wait, hold on. I should get. The, I should check the trap at least. Maybe I should just place them all and come back here some other time. For fuck! This is really one of my most the most annoying things in the game so far. Is getting stuck on basically nothing. I'll check this one and I'll I'll go back to where I heard another one and then maybe I'll ride around for a second see if I can hear the third one. Wait, there's this. Ooh. There's a tarp over it. That wasn't there before, I don't think. I don't hear the bird anymore, so I guess maybe it worked. Um, bird kit. Oh, here we go. Empty bird cage. Ah, bird Okay, so it worked. Okay, it didn't take that long. So let's go to the other one, because I heard that one, may as well do it. I might still leave it and just come back here at some other point in time, although I'll never find them, man, if I do that. The other one was around here somewhere. There it is. Alright, so we'll drop one here too. One empty bird cage. Fucking chuck it on the floor. <laughs> Alright. And then we'll look for the third one. And we'll come back here later. I can't imagine it's too difficult. Judging from the fact that the other two were so easily found. But still. I should make sure I'm in the right area still though. Um, bird in the hand. Oh, I'm certainly... Okay, it is quite a large area. Oh, also I should have placed a... Marker. Oh, there's the next one. That was easy enough. Um, my marker should be over here somewhere, I think. Yeah, somewhere like that. Oh, let's stop making noise. Oh, there we go. Alright, last one here. Fortunately, you can't place more than one marker. Oh, don't drop the Groshan. Oh, all right. I never took the uh, new shield, did I? Heavy shield? No, it's more mustard. I guess because I repaired my heavy shield. Only 98, by the way. This thing's got a lot of durability. 73. Yeah, we actually knew that because we checked it before. But still, it's not bad. All right, let me go back to the other one. Now, I can't place a marker here, so... But it's just next to the road. Okay. Let's see if this one's somehow already done. I don't know how long it takes, but... Wait, is that it? No, that's a tree stump. that be a tree stump right there? I've placed the marker here, but again, I didn't place the marker in the exact location where it was, so... I may have to do some actual searching. That's a rock. 
It's still making noise, so I'm guessing I didn't get it yet. There it is. Alright, um... <laughs> what we can do, I suppose, is, um... Just go away from it and just say, let's wait for, I don't know, maybe an hour? I don't want to wait too long. Yeah, let's do one hour, because it's going to get nighttime soon, and it's going to get dark. And I don't know yet in this game how everything works, but I don't really want to be out here in the dark, not knowing exactly what's going on. Also, your energy goes down far too slowly in this game. So does nourishment. If this one's done, which it is, I can see the tarp, nice, then the other one should be as well. So I think we're good. Ah, pick it up! Ah. Alright, so the other one was just slightly southwest, not entirely west, and then next to the road. The noise of the bird, of course, helps, although if you've got it already, then there won't be any noise, so it doesn't help that much. Wait, is this the road? I think it might be. Yeah, so it's a little bit to the south. Is that it? No. It certainly isn't. Where be it at? Oh shit, I'm far too... Okay, hold on. Like this way. It's a very, um... Fine line. There it is. Nice! Quest donezo. I don't know how we're gonna get for this anymore, but... <gasps> There we go. Bring the nightingales to the huntsman. Oh, I most certainly will. This has been my favorite thing so far in this game, by absolute far. These type of free roam, and it, the whole game is free roam. If I don't want to do the main quest, I mean, you have to kind of do the main quest in order to finish the game, I think, but if I don't want to do the main quest right now, I don't have to. I could now just go off on my own and do whatever the hell I want to do. Obviously, the more main quests I do, the easy, like the more quests and stuff I'll get. But right, this can be a dangerous thing to go down here. But we're gonna do it anyway. But yeah, like this is my favorite part so far. I love the story. Don't get me wrong. Like I'm absolutely loving the story and the main story less quests. But so far, the bandit camps. I don't know. It's just been so much fun trying to find a way to kill them. This one was obviously so much easier because of our gear. This is the most annoying thing in the game, unfortunately. But yeah, my gear has been an absolute help. Uh, I need to take away my there we go, marker. It's been ha very useful having this gear. And I'm certainly going to repair it again with the money we're going to make from all this other gear. I uh, don't know if it matters, but which path should I take? Which path should I take? It's Friday. Um, it's actually first day today. But yeah, I don't know. It just, the free roam is just so good. Also, you can actually make your horse, I think if you do, hold on, let me try this. Along a path, and then you just do this, and then my camera should like fix itself, and then you should stay along the path. No, I don't know how you do it actually, but like your, your horse should be able to f maintain it a path. Oh, I've reached a level of horsemanship. Maybe it does it right now? No, I don't know how you do it. Fuck it, I don't care enough right now. Okay, so we're back here. I should immediately, while I'm here, drop off a whole bunch of arrows and stuff. It's gonna be kind of difficult to guess what I need to drop exactly. But it has to be some stuff, so... You turn- oh shit! That's not what I meant to do. Stop! Stop riding! Oh my word. Uh, for some reason I- Oh my word. What the heck is going on? For some reason I thought you could do a U-turn with a horse. So I, I press the spacebar, like, handbrake. Somehow, surprisingly, I don't know how in the world, but it didn't work. I know! <laughs> how odd, right? Anyway. Use a bit of teleportation there to get closer. Actually, I need some food. I can eat again, so let's eat from this pot. Nice. Nice! Open this. Alright, so let's throw in some things, some fangs. We don't need this many bandages. Also, these bandages going bad. Or, I don't I don't think they would go bad. I just... Anyway, let's, um, let's drop... Now, let's keep those. Let's drop, like, five of these. That's a one kilogram right there. It'll help. 
So weapons, we don't need 59 arrows. Long distance arrows, better hunting, better piercing. Let's drop that one because we only have one. I wonder if it's worth keeping a secondary shield. Maybe not on me, but I certainly don't need to keep my mercenary's bedfall on me. It turns out that was a massive over-exaggeration. I was just afraid this sword was going to die super quickly. So we'll get rid of that. Tournament arrow, we don't need that one. This bow we're going to sell. I'll keep my bow because it's better. Um, I think I might want to keep a shield, but I should repair it first, I guess. Eh, there's no point, really. I'll just sell this. So, long distance arrow or a better hunting arrow, which is better? This one's definitely better. Yeah. Um, let's drop those for now then. And I think we're gonna drop a bunch of these as well. Let's drop 29, keep 30 of them on me. I think 30 arrows should be good for a while, right? Um, probably still too much and it already is weighing down on me. And we got 16 piercing arrows, right? Let's drop those as well. We'll equip these ones instead. Okay. Anything here that I might want to keep for any reason? Probably not. Probably no purse. No, I don't think so. I'm going to sell all this crap. All this crud. Red deer venison. I guess I can cook that. That'll be pretty good meat. So I should probably do that. And everything here I want to sell as well. We've got some blacksmith's kits as well, which will help. Tusk. Why the hell is that even a thing? Alright. Let's cook our red deer venison. Also, hello, Teresa. So, that should now be pretty good food, actually, I imagine. Cooked red deer venison. It's only 56 still, so I might want to eat it soon. It's probably going to overnourish me, but I guess I'll eat it now. 108. Yep, I'm incredibly overnourished. Pretty sure I could talk be to her now. Be a bit more now. careful. Jesus Christ. I could probably talk to her now to do this other quest, but... Honestly, I need to sell crap. Because if I need anything in the way of walking around or anything, I'm going to be absolutely fucked during this quest, so... Horse, please, come over here! <laughs> oh, man. Still not my horse. But this thing has been absolutely fucking faithful to me. If I hadn't found this horse there, I actually don't know what I would have done. Because if I hadn't, how in the fuck would I have ever done... Well, first of all, I, could, I wouldn't have been able to carry the, the stuff back from the initial bandit camp. And I probably wouldn't have... Is this already the path, actually? Is it further? Yes, this is the one. I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have... I definitely wouldn't have done the second one either, because I probably wouldn't have bothered running over there, because it takes fucking ages to get there. Well. Running without a horse. And I wouldn't have been able to carry anything back anyway, so what would have been the point? I would have gotten good gear from the first one. That's for sure. Are the stores still open? I sure hope they are. Uh... Henry, I'm glad you came. <laughs> I have some weapons to sell. Might just be too late though, which means I should go back to the other place and sleep. God, save, Henry. God damn it, okay. I guess we're going back to sleep. Um, alright, well in that case, I will just, um, see you guys when I get there. Alright, here we are. I'm going to sleep. She already no, she's not asleep yet. It's probably still quite early. It's like seven or eight or something. Sit. Slap. I finally won't have to use one of my quick saves, of which I think I only have one left now. Oh no, it's nine o'clock. Yeah, it's not too bad. Let's um we have full on energy. Well the thing is the stores won't open until what, nine o'clock? Oh, that's a long night's sleep. Let's um let's say until, yeah, let's say until 6, and I'll just walk there, and then I'll wait a couple hours in front of the store, I think. That makes more sense, I reckon, than sleeping for that long. Energy's all the way back up again, so that's good. My nourishment's going down, but not by too much. We can always eat from some random pot again if we need it. I need to actually keep track at some point of how much that actually gives. Like, nourish nourishment-wise. Because it would be useful to know when I'm overfed, or when I would overfeed myself from when I wouldn't. I still don't quite know how the feeding system works in this game, really, but... 
Right. Also don't know what last hour always takes so damn long. Game saved. Good, good. Alright, so this is where I will end this episode. Thank you guys very much for watching. Next time we're going to go to town. We're going to sell our trash. And then we're going to probably do the main quest or something. Until then, have a good day and goodbye.